It's a sad day in the world of television as we bid farewell to a true pioneer, Phil Donahue, who passed away at the age of 88. Known to many as the king of daytime talk shows, Donahue revolutionized the television industry with his groundbreaking show, Less Than M Greater Than The Phil Donahue Show, Less Than M Greater Than, which aired from 1967 to 1996. His influence on the genre is undeniable, and his legacy will continue to inspire future generations of broadcasters and journalists. Phil Donahue's career was nothing short of remarkable. Born in Cleveland, Ohio in 1935, Donahue began his broadcasting journey after graduating from the University of Notre Dame with a degree in business administration. It wasn't long before he found his true calling in television, where he quickly made a name for himself as a bold and innovative host. In 1967, he launched Less Than M, Greater Than the Phil Donahue Show, Less Than, Greater Than at Dayton's WLWD television station. Little did anyone know at the time, this show would change the landscape of daytime television forever. Donahue's show was revolutionary in its format. He was the first to incorporate audience participation into a talk show, a feature that became a hallmark of his program. This approach brought a new level of engagement and interactivity, allowing viewers to feel like they were part of the conversation. It was this very format that paved the way for future talk show giants like Oprah Winfrey, who herself acknowledged that without Donahue, her own show might not have existed. Over the course of his career, Donahue touched on a wide array of topics, many of which were considered controversial at the time. He wasn't afraid to tackle hot-button issues such as feminism, homosexuality, consumer protection, and civil rights. His fearless approach to addressing these topics garnered him both praise and criticism, but it was his commitment to honest, open dialogue that set him apart from his peers. Donahue's ability to navigate these complex discussions with sensitivity and respect won him numerous accolades, including 20 Emmy Awards and a Peabody Award in 1980. One of Donahue's most memorable moments came earlier this year when he was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom by President Joe Biden. The White House recognized Donahue as a television pioneer who had changed the way we discuss important issues on air. This prestigious honor was a fitting tribute to a man who had spent nearly three decades steering the nation's discourse through his daily conversations with both ordinary people and prominent figures alike. Phil Donahue's impact extended far beyond his television career. He was also a devoted husband to actress Marlo Thomas, whom he married in 1980. The couple's relationship became a symbol of lasting love, and in 2020, they released a book titled Less Than M, Greater Than What Makes Marriage Last Le Less Than, Less Than, where they shared insights from their own marriage and those of other celebrated couples. Their partnership was a testament to Donahue's character, both as a public figure and as a person. As we remember Phil Donahue, we are reminded of the significant contributions he made to the world of media and the lasting influence he has had on the talk show format. His ability to connect with audiences, tackle difficult subjects, and create a space for meaningful conversation will be remembered as his greatest legacy. In lieu of flowers, his family has requested that donations be made to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, or the Phil Donahue Notre Dame Scholarship Fund, a reflection of Donahue's lifelong commitment to making a positive impact in the world. Phil Donahue may be gone, but his voice and his vision will continue to resonate in the hearts and minds of those who were touched by his work. His contributions to television and to society at large will not be forgotten. Rest in peace, Phil Donahue. You will be greatly missed. Stay subscribed for more videos.